Imagine, if you will, a large group of men spending two hours with brooms in their hands. I know it's tough, but that's exactly what Vic McCarty recently found while visiting the Lewiston Curling Club just southeast of Gaylord, where men aren't afraid of doing a little sweeping. The oldest curling club in North America is in Montreal, while the only curling club in northern Michigan is in Lewiston, southeast of Gaylord. Is Mark got shot, Rock? Curling is four-man teams throwing eight stones as close to the middle of those circles. And it sounds and looks easy. It looks easy, but it's, it's a heck of a lot complicated, and, uh, you know, there's a lot involved. Jeremy Cosby, who's from Gaylord, has been playing here in Lewiston for four years, and he admits he's hooked. Definitely, definitely. Uh, like I said, it's like golf. Now, some have described curling as a cross between shuffleboard and chess, or even ballet on ice. But the more popular reference might be men with brooms. The brooms are used to, yes, yeah, sweep in front of the stone to help it go farther, and that means, well, a lot of sweeping. Is this the only time you ever see these men with brooms in their hands? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yes. But this isn't just an old boys club. The ladies like to curl, too. Judy Johnson used to play in Lewiston in a league against her husband. Absolutely. And she says it's possible that women are better than the men. You know, women are, are used to multitasking, and I think sometimes that comes in handy. Lewiston's curling club season ended this weekend, but it's never too late to start. The club actually rents out ice time for groups who want to play and or learn. In Lewiston, Vic McCarty, 9 and 10 Sports. Thank you, Vic. The line